All right, we got the man DCA versus Volt from Anaheim. That's crazy. That's my hometown. Shout out to the, the crib. And if, for those of you that don't know, DCA is actually retired. It's pretty crazy, but he's still here. Retired, by the way. And DDD getting that up throw, up almost up throw up here. I've actually never seen DDD's up, up throw. Oh, but that smash will send him down to the pits of hell where he belongs. Just like the Kratos meme. If I don't, if I remember correctly, I think Volt was in the crew battle. I, I, I saw his DDD. I was kind of taking pictures somewhere else, but DC, I think, was commentating. So this is definitely a good, a good rematch. DC is looking for, looking for the money, trying to bring back the glory to San Diego. But that bounce, oh, that was a good, that was a good bait. They ran out that Gordo to get him bounced, but Bolt was after that up tilt the whole time. And he's pull. Oh, okay, okay, I see you, I see you. I, I haven't been doing replays this whole time, but you know what? Just for that, I'm gonna start doing it because that, that was a really good one. DCA almost taking that first one, but not quite. Yeah, DCA is retired, so like, we couldn't be part of the crew battle. I don't even know why we're letting him play. Oh, and that too far, and Volt will take that first game. Yo, let's let's watch this one again though. I, I gotta show you guys this one again because that, that was a sweet play. Volt coming in, throwing out that Gordo, and just coming in with that turnaround uh, up tilt. Very well played. Very, very well played. I love the burp tag. Did you guys know that birds aren't real? Yeah, it's crazy. They're just plants by the government to be able to track us every, at every move. So the next time you see a bird, just scream. <laughs> anyway, back to the match. That's why we're all here. DCA doing some hero shenanigans. But Volt is having none of it. He's looking for that grab. He's looking for anything. He just has no fear. And he's coming in hot with those, oh, that Nair, that suck. Good ledge pressure with that Gordo. Almost getting something with that downbeat, but not quite. And DC instead being able to land a pretty good aerial off of that. All right, here's an interesting question for you guys. 
Oh. 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 Oh, there we go. Yeah, that that will definitely do that. That was crazy. Wow. Let's go, Burb, from the chat, uh, from the from the, from the, the the room next door. And Burb missing that that uh, sleep. Anyway, I was gonna ask you guys, when Hero does that thing when he flies up off stage, above the stage, and like is gonna land anywhere. Do you guys think it's worth it to try to predict where he's going to be and punish him? Or do you just like set up some trap of your own and do something else? Because I've heard it from both players. I personally feel like it's better to like, you know, like you're not really going to know where he's going to land. So I might as well just not bother with it. Because if you do that, you're probably going to put yourself in a worse situation. But Bo definitely has his, uh, his game plan right now against Hero. <laughs> Very tricky character to have a game plan against, even if you are the hero, because that RNG will be either in your favor or against. You never really know. And <laughs> that, that cheesy uh, hitbox coming out from that up B landing. An interesting interaction there by DCA actually looking to get hit by the Gordo because that reflect, that bounce can be such a crazy move, especially because, you know, it just kind of changes the whole the whole game when it's out if you have a, a gear character with projectiles. And that up throw will definitely do it. DDD, bad as hell, but that up throw off the top will take that stock and putting him at the deficit. And DC is looking to extend his lead by any means necessary. Ariel is coming out. Crazy. Not able to get that Gordo. Not able to get these aerials, but that backer will do the trick. Putting some pressure on him. See, that's what I mean. So, so that kind of interaction where uh, Volt was like, uh, he did get the location right, but missed the timing. And I feel like ultimately, if you are not the hero, you will not know the timing as well as a person who actually plays hero. And so is it really worth it to go for it? Who knows? But Volt did a good job of taking that second stock from DCA, trying to even things out. Good down air neutral. Look for that back air because this does a very pretty strong amount. But DC is having none of it right now. He's having none of it. Telling him that oh wow, that Star KO will do it. GG is then well played. It is 1-1 right now. And let's watch this one again, shall we? That, that was a hell of a moment. I, I, it's very rare to see the to see the hero get turned to stone. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you, you can't. You did have that one coming, and and he is definitely taking, like, pushing that uh, benefit to the... Sorry, I can't speak right now. He definitely did the most in that moment right there. That's a great whiff punish by Volt. It is 1-1. One, one. We're back on PS2. And we'll come in with those up tilts. Trying to see what we can do. My favorite song. I have my, my computer hooked up to the speakers in the other room, so, you know, we got the good vibes here at the pit. Always trying to keep a good atmosphere. Keep it competitive for players. So help them stay focused. And DCA, once again, has that bounce out. Meaning that, oh, that Gordo coming in, doing a little bit of damage, but ended up losing a stock for that one. Pretty bold with that F smash from Volt, but not quite able to get what he wants. And instead, DCA is taking the opportunity to lay out a some hits of his own. Good Gordo suck there. Even if... He, uh, he doesn't get a lot out of it. He's still making him shield, still making him respect that pressure and respect the the, the, the aerial, you know, respect the the zone. But once DCA gets that bounce out, then it really kind of invalidates that whole level of neutral. But that, that wow, that will kill. And Volt is now at his last stock. See, we really should have put in DCA for the crew battle, maybe. Maybe things go on differently. But who knows? That down smash, down air. Uh -huh. 
that was that was a pretty good coverage by uh, Volt instead of you know trying to go for some sort of aerial hit. Just instead goes for the corridor to try to cover the pressure, but once again. Oh, and that sleep. Is that gonna do it? No way. Wow. Wow. Well, very well played. Very well played. Hero do be like that. 